Hello YouTube, this is me once again. Now a web blogger kindly asked, what about Bangalore's in E8? Does it work well with the Apple Watch? Now this is series one, by the way. So if you have series two or series three, I can guarantee you that it's gonna work even better than this one because it's the first model. And series two and series three is known to be much better than series one, or maybe they're pretty similar, but this is the oldest. So I'm gonna show you a demonstration based on this series one uh, Apple Watch. And what I'm gonna do is first turn on the Bang & Olufsen E8. You press the right button, and you can see that the blue light is coming out. And immediately, you should see that in the Bluetooth, yep, there you go, it's connected, okay? So it's all ready to go. And to show you how well the sound is synchronized, I'm gonna place this right-hand side earbud near to my recorder's microphone jack. So it's all balanced. Okay, so all ready to go. Let's go to the music library. And I randomly chose uh, the second law by Muse album. And I'm going to play Panic Station. So immediately, you can see that the Apple Watch is showing you uh, the track. And what you do is, if you want to go for the next track, you go. So you can see that it's immediately changing. And then what about volume adjustment? Um, and so on. So I hope you can hear that. And then next track. I'm not sure what these dots are for, to be honest with you, I never use them, but um, I really don't know what that is for. Maybe that's only a special, f oh, there you go. You get deleted and so on. So let's just cancel that. That's an extra function. So you can see that it pretty much works well with the Apple Watch while you use the library. But what about if we use the Amazon Music, because I'm, I'm sure many of you out there are Amazon Prime member. So I'm gonna turn on the Amazon Prime Music. I'm sure it works on different music players as well, if you wanna query that about, but I don't listen to any other, but let's listen to Amazon Music. And um, I tend to listen, well, why not we try the 50 Great Happy Songs, because it's a happier movie clip that we're recording here. So let's play Feels, nice track. And then immediately, oh actually now it's changed to um, Feels on Amazon. So you could, sorry, so not Siri, <laughs> sorry. Now you go to next track. Now that is very weird, okay. I think it's mainly because uh, it needs to load in time. Oh, now it's working very well. Now, because as you know, um, Amazon needs a uh, data to be downloaded. I mean, we've got a pretty good internet here, but it's still a bit of a lag there. But once it's downloaded, yeah. You can see that the track is pretty good. Um, synchronize and so on if you want to change the volume you can see the difference here now um, you might wonder well why do you actually need this function as an Apple Watch well just want to prove to you that there's no I cannot see any benefit of owning an AirPod when you actually have a slightly more expensive but yet much better design and best sound better much better sound quality than the um, air AirPod and it's tightly secured in your ear as well. Um, well, that's one thing I want to show you. So it works like an Apple product. And second of all is is that when you put this on your ear and let's say you want to press this and this and this, whatever it is, you might look too geeky in, in the public space. So if you're a bit embarrassed to look too much geeky um, in, in the public space, what you do is you use your Apple Watch, pretending you're watching your time, or you receive you you pretend you receive a text message from your friend. But all you need to do is just flick here and there and change the track. Um, so I hope this video sort of demonstrated how well this Bang & Listen E8 is synchronized with your 
um, Apple Watch. And if you have any more further queries, please do not hesitate and ask me a question. I, as you know, I'm trying my best to come back to you, trying my best to come back to you with your queries. And um, I hope this video also fulfilled that duty in some ways. So thank you very much for watching this video. This is Love Jesus, please. Bye.